That was a yes. <laughs> Wrap myself up in there. It's like a little fucking burrito. What is, oh God, okay. What the fuck? What did I order? Oh, that's why he was done, folks. Oh, hello, sir. Get the fuck off the bench. <laughs> hello, and welcome back. You can see my cute little puppy dog. Hello, Foxy. Do, would you like to say hello? Oh, that was a yes. Anyway, welcome back. We've got a little bit of a fun one today. So, I just got back from the post office from getting this bitch renewed, my passport, because I tell you what, folks, in January... I don't know where I'm going yet, but I am, <laughs> goodbye, packing my suitcase and going somewhere. Not forever, unfortunately, but for about a week, going to go somewhere. But anyway, went and got it renewed because at least in about two to six weeks when it arrives, I can start booking my flights and going somewhere. But I tell you what, ready? Hold up. Wait, nah, I'm going to put it up here so you guys can see the full effect of this tragic tragic ass photo we got new ones oh also a much of an improvement <laughs> am i wrong they're not any better thank god my boyfriend did my goddamn eyebrows for me on thursday because holy crap they were like they were caterpillars folks but anyway we got our passport she is on the way hell yeah that was not the point of this video um the point of this video is it was my birthday yesterday. I turned 26. Stop it. I know. Don't look a day over 18. Let me have this. Anyway. Uh, yeah. So I thought I would show you guys what my amazing boyfriend got me and his wonderful goddamn parents because um, they got me something as well. And they're two things that I just absolutely amaze. Um, but yeah, we're gonna. I'm going to go through all of my presents and i'm going to show you guys what i got and then as well it's a good day folks because machine order arrived so we are also going to go through that today we've got a lot of we've got a lot of unpacking i was a very spoiled girl yesterday i'm a very lucky very very lucky girl like i love him incredibly much and you know what i just can't i can't wait for his birthday because i already have like i already had plans for his birthday but the fact that he put so much time and care and love and effort into my birthday yesterday just solidified the fact that i'm like oh yeah he's just as wonderful around birthdays as what i am so i'm gonna do all of my crazy little ideas um and he's just gonna have to deal with it and brad if you're watching like i'm sorry but i love you and it's just the way that it is um but yeah, anyway, let's get started. I cannot, I cannot wait to actually show you guys everything that this man got me because I am, I am in awe. I cried. I cried when his parents gave me the presents and I felt like an absolute dickhead because it's like, oh my God, happy birthday here. And I'm like, oh, thank you so much. You're an idiot, Samantha. But anyway, so I cannot wait to show you what they got me and what Brad got me as well. I'm going to gonna start showing you that now okay so first of all i wanted to show you what brad's parents got for me and they're just such amazing people his parents honestly like they're very very caring and very loving and like i don't know if brad told them i don't know if i even told brad i don't know but i've been wanting a money box for ages because i don't really use cash that often but when i do have cash and i have coins I do not want the coins in my car, in my bag, or in my purse, anything. Like, I just don't like coins. So, they got me a money box because I've been wanting one for ages. And just, like, I love this thing. It is so beautiful. It has a cute little message on the back. And she gave it to me with a coin. I put some coins in there already um, because it's bad luck to give, like, a purse or a coin box or a money box or anything without a coin in it. So, she put a coin in there for me. So, I love that so much. They also got me this beautiful throw blanket. And like, I know you guys can't feel it, but just just trust me when I tell you that I'm gonna rug, wrap myself up in there. It's like a little fucking burrito. And this is gonna be my blanket. Even though it's summer, well, it's spring, but even though it's summer, this is gonna be my blanket. Goodbye bedding. She is it. 
anyway so that's what Prad's parents got for me that um and I love them so much for it like I I'll admit I cried like I did cry when they gave me the present and but it's just like I don't normally like my family and I we do gifts but it's more like concert tickets and things like that and like not little things like this like we don't really see the need for it and it's just it's really nice to you know get that and yeah anyway I'm a sook and I'm broken so I cried like a baby but to me it's fine anyway moving on look at that my boyfriend is better than yours because ow um because look at this I love Legos love succulents so you know <laughs> what do you mean he's just amazing I can't I just fucking can't anyway I cannot wait to build this um whether it be with him while I lose my marbles because apparently it is where is it uh, 771 pieces why could it not be 72 or just 70 what is that one piece that is so annoying I cannot wait to I cannot wait to build that and anyway, my boyfriend also does this thing like show bags for people's birthdays and it's re it's really cute because it's just like a bunch of cute little cheap things in a bag but anyway this is the other part of the gift so I've never really brought this up before but I love Emperor's New Groove it is my all-time favorite movie and I love Devil and Angel Kronk so I got the pops. I didn't really, I knew they existed, but I didn't know that you could like still kind of get them. And he got me that, he got me the devil, which arrived on time, but the angel is still coming. And I actually have the tattoos. I'll take a photo and I'll pop it up here. But I have the tattoos to match the angel and devil cronk. So I'm so happy that he got me that. The angel one is coming. And then also... So I'm a country gal. I love my country music. If you didn't know, I flew to Melbourne to go see Morgan Wallen. And I love, love Luke Combs. But anyway. I didn't, when I went to Morgan Wallen, I was broke as hell. And I literally flew there for the concert because he was the only reason I was going. Like my friend Tess, my best friend Tess lives over there. And like I was... I wasn't staying with her. I don't know if I was staying with her. I can't remember. But either way, it was a very cheap, cheap trip. So I didn't afford, I couldn't afford merch. So this man bought me merch. Because he is adorable and thinks of king everything. I don't deserve this man. He is amazing. And I honestly, and you know what, folks? That's actually not it not it i was a blubbering mess when this oh we got back oh my god okay wait we got back from the shops yesterday morning and i met him downstairs at his house and he was upstairs i thought he was just getting his shoes no he was like propping up everything on the bed so nice all wrapped up in a bag so when we got back he was like happy birthday baby and i just I'm the luckiest girl in the world, honestly. I just. My heart, man, my heart. Okay, this is the show bag. I love my squishies. You can see I have an obsession. Brad fueled this obsession. I think I had like two or three before we started dating. The rest all came from Brad. But they, it's the Sniffy collection. Look at it. Look at him. His name's Pepper. But he smells like... It's like strawberries or like... Like strawberry fairy floss or something. He's so good. I love him so much. I have an obsession with socks. I love my socks. I have a collection. So you got me Mewtwo... Well, not Mewtwo, but Mew socks. And little dino socks because I love dinosaurs. They're like my favourite animal ever. And um, because they're extinct, crocodiles are actually my favourite animal because they're the next closest thing. But he also got me a white pair with cute little green dinos on them. But I was wearing them yesterday, so they're in the wash now. I love my little makeup headbands. 
So he got me the one that I didn't have. Uh, I'm gonna start crying all over again, guys. Kinder chocolate. Because I have a fucking problem. That was dramatic. And I love candles. And we all know that, like, Kmart, even though we all like, oh my god, it's Kmart. It's Kmart. It's fucking Kmart. And we love Kmart. So I got the... I got the water lily and lotus and the salted caramel. And if you guys have not tried these, I swear to God, go get them. They're like literally 3 or $4 or some crap like that. They're a cute little jar. So when you finish with the candle, you can wash it out and reuse the jar. And if you all like me and you like to garden, if anybody knows what I'm talking about, they're the perfect size to, to, to store said herbs um anyway it's Lodano Deadpool look at him isn't he so cute I love him he's got a little bubble head I love him I love him that was actually kind of like a joke trick because Brad there's got like this little collection out at the moment and Brad was trying to get the Caesar Deadpool but he got the dino Deadpool instead. So he was like, oh, I can't keep that for myself. That has to go to Sam. And I'm like, oh. yes, obviously. Oh, and then also, so another part of my birthday present was actually getting my hair cut because Brad's a barber and my eyebrows wax because they're doing the eyes and like the nostrils and everything at Brad's work at the moment. So... That was another part of my present. He, on Thursday last week, he cut my hair, cut all my dead ends off and made it all one goddamn length because when I cut my hair, apparently the front was like this much shorter than the back. And I'm like, that's, look, I'm no professional. It's fine. Um, And his co-worker had a really lovely hair oil. So I asked her if I could take, well, Brad took a photo of it on my phone and we went and got some. So we got this Lux oil and I got this miracle hair treatment because I've used this before and this is amazing. Um, but it's Lux oil reconstructive elixir. And you just put like a couple of drops or a couple of little ch -ch -ch in your hand. And like just through the ends of your hair once you've gotten out of the shower and stuff. And then this one you do the same. Um, about a 20 cent piece size on your palm and mix it through and put it through the ends of your hair. And I tell ya... I am excited for healthy hair again. But guys, like... What do you mean? I am genuinely the luckiest, luckiest girl in the fucking world. I... I cry all over again. And you know what? These things are like... Like the headband. And the fucking socks. These are all things that like... I told him I have a collection of like funky socks. When we first started dating like nine months ago. Or eight months ago. I don't know. In like November last year. And he bought me socks. And then like... It was like three or four weeks ago, I, was, I told him, we went into JJ's. And I was like, oh my God, this is the only one that I don't have. So what did he do? He went and bought it for me, for my birthday. I love squishies. What do you call me a squish? Okay, well, that was everything that I got for my birthday, which, oh, actually, no, it wasn't. That's a lie. Um, from my mum, my brother, well, my two brothers and I have all got tickets to go see Parkway Drive on the 30th. Um, I believe at RAC Arena, I think it is. Um, so I got that for my birthday as well, which I'm super duper excited for. Anyway, <laughs> let's crack into Sheen. I actually can't even remember what I ordered. We love that. All right. Wait, what? Why 
Why is it like... Why is it double back? You bloody weirdos. Unbelievable. Anyway, okay. Let's just get into it. All right. What the? What the? It is. I don't know. But let's find out. Bum, bum, bum. What the zip? What do you mean? Well, what the fuck was the point of that? Uh, what did I even order, dude? Oh my god! Yeah! Forgot about that. Wait, I'm gonna open it the wrong way so I can show you guys quicker. Dun, 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 dun. Oh my god! Look at how cute that is. Alright, it's a glitter spray. Look. Look. I said look. Anyway, um, I feel like a fucking idiot. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, guys, it actually works. That is actually so cute. Oh, I love. Oh, I'm pretty. I'm pretty and sparkly. Okay, I love, I love. Happy purchaser. Anyway. Let's keep the bowl rolling. These are from my mum. They're laundry things. They're, that's boring. I got a garlic mincer for my boyfriend because we've been cooking at his house lately and I haven't been, like, I can't chop or dice garlic to save me life. I got a lip duo from Shaglam. I'm going to show you these guys, like show you these things a little bit closer up once I've actually opened them. Oh my God. Yeah. Okay. I ordered like dumplings makers because like I said, I'm getting into cooking and I like cooking. Oh, okay. I ordered suction, suction cup lick mats for my cat, for my cat. Um, because it's supposed to help with their anxiety and their digestive system and things like that. And because it's suction cup, so you can put it on like the doors and the tiles and it won't wiggle away. So I got three of them. That's two in a fine one. Oh my God. Okay. I got a real cute tissue box. Look at it. It's like little bubbles. I'll show you it when it's actually out of the friggin' out of the bio. But that's really cute. I'm glad. I got fake flowers for for something that you will see in a second. I got socks, which is funny because socks is actually just over there. <laughs> I don't know why this one's bubble wrapped, but these two weren't. But these are all Shaglam Lip Duos, and this is oh, a brow gel. Oh, translucent foundation powder, like setting powder. Um, I got more Shiglam. What are these? I don't know. What are these? Oh, I have very oily skin. So I got some of the oil, like absorbing paper that you can just dab around you know you see do you think oh they're for brad as well okay so he got sunglasses so these two things are for my love my love i don't know why the fuck he dates me either guys i just i'm a wee bit broken folks it's just a wee bit what the fuck is that a oh, hair wax stick because i'm an alpha scurly now and I need to be professional. Professional. What are these? What are they? What? Ah! Ah! Oh! Oh, yeah, I ordered a bikini because you know spring, and you girls put on weight, so I needed a bikini that covered my tees. 
Yep. Mm, mm, mm. What is this? Oh, mum's organising her her drawers and stuff. When she does these, I'll update you guys. But um, I'll show you the little theme pull up for them. They're like drawer organisers. What is this? What is... Oh, God, okay. What the fuck? What did I order? What did I order? Sorry. You guys can't see me, but my dog's in the background there cheering me on. But, oh, this is the cutie part. This is what the fake flowers are for, folks. It's plastic, but it's, it's a book, but it's a vase. And I don't want real flowers in amongst all my books. I want fake flowers. So I've got them. And I'm going to put the purple one. Oh, they're very short. I probably should have read it through. Oh, well. And I've got white tulips here. Um, to use. Fake white tulips. I got hair ties. Which, bruh. I ordered plain black. Why? Why'd they look like this? Anyway. Oh, it's the third lick mat. Amazing. Oh, this is for the baby. I say baby, but like, all of my friends that have actually had children will probably watch this and be like, bitch, the fuck are you talking about? It's for my dog, okay, folks. It's for my dog. Because you put little treaties in there and, like, he gets it out. And you watch, I'll fucking, <laughs> this will be destroyed in about a minute. You'll see. Oh, and skewers, because, you know, Luke and I partake in the gardening. And we need them. So, anyway, that was interesting. I'm going to, like, set, I'm going to get rid of the rubbish. And I'm going to set some things up. And I'm going to show you guys how cute they are. And what they actually look like. Um, and I'm also going to give my dog his treat so we can see my doggy with his little, little treat. These cute little treats. I need to stop talking. He's such a good boy. He's such a good boy. He's such a good boy. He's so cute. Um, although that three dollar bowl from Sheen did not last long because I'm seeing now on one of the sides is split. But it, you know what? It's fine. It gave him a little bit of fun, and that's all that matters. I should have brought like seven of them, but oh well. Anyway. So he's on his cat tower and he normally loves to sit in this bowl here. Um, I was going to pop it in the bowl, but I was like, maybe the first time with him doing it, he should be standing. So I propped it up, but he looks like he is loving it. My cat is so cute. I'm eating out of a tub of watermelon and rock melon because I have a problem. And um, this is what my mum and I do. We just do like a giant fruit salad and we just snack out of it. But I'm thinking what I'm going to do now is after I eat this entire tub of watermelon and rock melon, because we all know that we will. Well, I will. I'm going to go have a shower, wash my rat nest of a head of hair and put in... My new Miracle Hair Treatment from Eleven and my new Elixir Oil or Lux Oil, whatever it's called, um, from Weller. And I'm going to pop them in my hair. And then we have like... <sighs> Not a fun amount of cleaning to do. None of us like cleaning. We're going to clean before people get home. Bake some cookies before people get home. But...
you all know how to make cookies properly so i just got these from aldi because aldi's cheap and they are the best cookies in the entire world they take like 15 20 minutes in the oven and that's it perfection so we're gonna make some cookies i think it's done you're done bubby I can still see remnants in there. I should probably stop eating the watermelon. Oh, that's why he was done, folks. Oh, hello, sir. Get the fuck off the bench. All right. That's what we're going to do. We are going to go have a shower and wash our hair. My hair. I don't know why I'm saying ow. But we're going to go have a shower. And we're going to go wash my hair. And we're going to go put the new hair treatment in because we're gonna be all pretty and be like a girly girl. And then we're gonna come out here and combat these bitch ass dishes. <sighs> Our shower takes forever to get warm, so I always have a hot water tap on first. But this is the face wash that I use because I have like incredibly oily skin. Um, so this has salicylic acid in it. I think that's how you pronounce it. And that helps the oils in my skin go away or the bad away from my skin go away so this is what i use i feel so much better now i'm not gonna lie <clears throat> this is one of the cute little headbands that i have and like it's a cute little moo cow and if you're like my mother the first thing she said is oh my god it suits you because you are a cow but all in good work. All in, all in good spirits? I don't know. One of the two. It's cute though, and I'm cute, so whatever. Uh, we're quickly gonna do my skin toner while, before I do my hair, because I need to comb through my hair, so we're gonna quickly do that first. And I got it from Kmart, I'm not gonna lie, it's the same. It has the salicylic acid in it, and it's supposed to help with my skin. I've been using, doing this, oh god. I've been doing this for like, um, a month, maybe, just over a month, um, and I've actually noticed that, like, my skin has been a lot clearer because I use the Garnier Skin Face Wash when I have a shower, and otherwise I use, it's the exact same colour and brand, Salicylic Acid, like, Cleansing Balm, which is also, like, a face wash which I use to clean my face after work every day. But because, you know, I don't have a job. Well, I start one, but I don't have one at the moment. Um, I've been doing that as often. I've just been doing the shower one, but it's fine. And I have a night one. My skin's been so much clearer and so much softer since I started doing it. But anyway, I'm gonna comb my hair. Do -do -do. Do, 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 do. Out, bitch. The chins. Mm. For the love of God. All right. I don't think this has a seal on it. Surely not. Eh. It. She does not, folks. She does not have a seal. Literally, that's about the amount that I use. That's probably way too much. My hairdresser friends are going to be like, Samantha, what are you doing wasting all that product? And I'm going to be like, you know what? Sue me. I'm not a hairdresser. Do my hair for me. You know what? They both could. Um, one's in Melbourne, though. So I probably, yeah, no. <laughs> Actually, she can't do it. When I go over for Billie Eilish, though, next year, and I think March, she might actually be able to do it. But, you know, I also haven't spoken to her about that at all. Also, my boyfriend's really cool, and he gave me a proper, like, a wool hairdryer. Hair Not that I know how to hairdry my hair properly, but I need to try it. Okay, now that she is all semi-dry, we don't want her fully dry, just semi-dry. I'm just gonna give her a little comb. Do -do -do. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Get all those knocked out again. 
How good a job did my boyfriend do cutting my hair, by the way? Got all the dead ends off, fixed up the fact that it was all uneven as hell, and made me look pretty by doing my eyebrows. Genuinely, I have a better boyfriend than you. Okay. That is not in English. No. Please don't have a seal. That smells so amazing. Okay. We are all done. Do, 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 do. You know what, I'm just gonna keep these in here you know, because I might as well. Okay, now you guys give me a second while I go from this. To this. So we're out the shower. We feel so much better. My hair feels and smells and just looks so much better. I'm so glad that I have my hair care back because I was broke for ages and my hair was so unhealthy and dying and weak. So I'm glad that I'm getting back into the routine of doing that. We are happy. Um, we've not got a lot on for this afternoon, so I might love yous and leave yous because I'm going to run to Coles. I'm going to go pick up some cost lettuce because I am in fact cooking dinner tonight. Um, and we're going to have chicken burgers. So I, I love Leonard's chicken. I used to work at the Leonard's chicken in Geraldton. Um, and I left working there, but I miss all the food that they used to do. And there's a Leonard's chicken down in Secret Harbor. Mum and I went down there the other day and we got some of the jumbo chicken patties. So I'm going to make us burgers. We get, oh, I've got the brioche buttons. I've got the chicken patties. I've got mayo and barbecue sauce to be able to make my little burger sauce. And all I need to do is go and get some lettuce. So I'm going to go get cost lettuce, which is a lot nicer. Um... And once I get back from the shops, I'm pretty sure I'm just going to go to Coles because it's just going to be so much easier. When I get back from the shops, I'm going to clean. So it's not like overly joyful and fun. Um, and then I'm not going to lie, I'm going to have something to eat and probably sit on my fat ass and watch TV until it's time to go do something which is watch basketball um oh actually no which has got to cook dinner i can't forget to cook dinner tonight um yeah when we get back from coles gonna do some cleaning um then i'm gonna bake some cookies the cookies that i showed you earlier they are <laughs> they are also fire uh so we're gonna cook them each roll makes about 30 i mean sorry each roll makes about 15 cookies so i'm gonna make about 30 um, cause I have an obsession. They're delicious. I love them. So I'm just going to cook them up because why not? So yes. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys had just as much fun today as I did filming. And yeah, I look forward to the next one.